So hundreds of people were here at the Otay Mesa Immigration and Detention Facility. Their message, keep families together and free. While our cameras weren't allowed inside of the facility, Senator Kamala Harris was here. She toured the inside of the facility and shared what she saw with the crowd. My heart is broken. Harris described the inside of an immigration and detention facility as a jail and the story she heard from women inside heartbreaking. Immigrant rights are human rights. As she toured that facility, people rallied nearby demanding the Trump administration reunite the thousands of children separated from their parents at the borders. Harris said while she was told parents have been able to call their children from detention facilities for free, today she learned otherwise. But when I sit down with the parents, it is very clear that they are charged for those calls. Now let's also be clear about what's happening in this prison they call a detention facility. For when they work, when they work and they are asked and they are charged with working, you know how much they are paid? One dollar a day. Harris went on to say those phone calls cost 85 cents a minute. She ended with a call for an immediate end to current immigration policy. No cages, no walls. So the message here from a lot of people today was that the executive order is no solution to families being separated. And once again, the question is what's happening inside of the detention facilities. You can see over my shoulder the van still parked right there in the driveway, security guards outside as well, making sure that no one goes past that core civic van and making sure that what's happening inside of the facility is out of sight for most. Jade Hindman, KPBS News.